I'm going to get my little swan here. At this point, I'm going to take him and I'm going to put him in. And then I've got some little cute little duckies here. And I'm going to take one of my drop flowers that I've got and I can put that in the front here. A little bit of interest. A couple eggs. Okay, that's about all I'm going to put in the front. Then I'm going to go ahead and I want to put the two of them together. Now I want to wait, let them sit up and let them dry, okay, before I put them together. So give them a good, oh, probably 15 minutes, half hour, and let these dry so that nobody's moving anywhere. And then I'm going to go ahead and put the eggs together. Okay, I'm going to go ahead and put these together. When I put it together, I want to make sure that I don't see the seam down in the bottom there. You can tell that the grass doesn't quite make it up to the lake. So what I'm going to do is fill in a little bit of this front here with some grass. It's okay that it goes down below. And then fill in a little bit back here so that it looks like it meets. I don't have a big gap. Then what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna take white. You don't have to use white, it's white. This is a number eight tip. And I'm just gonna go all the way around. And okay, a little bit's gonna squish out. It's okay, we'll wipe it off. And I'm just gonna put the two together, just like that. And as you can see, it squishes out. That's actually a good thing, because you wanna make sure you have a good seal. You don't want it to fall apart. And just pull it off, wipe it off. Okay. Make sure it sits together like it's supposed to. And now we're going to let that dry for a few minutes, and then we're going to decorate the outside. My base is now dry, and my frosting has had a little time to set up, so I'm going to go ahead and join my base with just a little bit of royal icing to my egg. Let me just set it down. And now I'm going to let that dry for a few minutes. 